You know Pete Melman? Fourth grade, Mr. Bard's class? The blonde kid? Yeah, yeah, Pete Melman. What about him? He crapped his pants today during social studies. He had to go to the nurse's office and have his mom bring him a fresh pair of jeans. <laughs> How do you know? Because, dude, it's all over Eavesdropper. Eavesdropper? What's that? <laughs> you guys don't follow Eavesdropper? It's a website about all the students in the school. Hey, did you guys see Eavesdropper? Pete Melvin's pants. Yeah, yeah, I'm showing the guys. Check it out. Eavesdropper got a hold of the phone call from the nurse to Pete Melman's mom. Just listen, listen, listen. Hello, Mrs. Melman. This is a school nurse. I'm afraid your son has had a little accident. <laughs> oh, no, what is it? Turn is it okay? up. No, no, it's not serious, but he went number two during class. I'm afraid he's going to need a new pair of pants and underwear. And a clean pair of socks. Hey, did you guys see Eavesdropper? Yeah, yeah, we're listening to it. <laughs> Come on down south by there and meet some friends of mine. Okay, okay, so what do we call Pete Melman when we see him? I was thinking Poopy Pants Pete, but, th but then I also thought of Mush Pants Melman. Attention South Park students, will the following students report to the principal's office immediately? Eric Cartman, thank you. Oh, Jesus, what now? You probably understand that for Pete, it isn't that funny. For him, it's embarrassing and terrifying. <laughs> right, that's why it's super funny to me. Eric, it has been almost one year since Corey Duran defecated in his pants here at school. Now, you remember what happened to him? Yeah, he killed himself. Yes, and the reason he killed himself, Eric, was that the ridicule and the torment from other students spearheaded by you caused hey, him... Whoa. Spearheaded by you, okay, made him feel there was no hey, other whoa, way out. Whoa. We've been through this. You cannot put Cory Duran's death on me. I'm not the one who crapped his pants in front of everyone. Eric, we are asking you to please just remember what happened to Cory and not let it happen to Pete. Please just let it go. <laughs> You're asking me to simply ignore a kid who, excuse my language, but I have to be harsh here, a kid who sh in his pants in front of everyone to just ignore that so he can have a normal life? We are hoping that if you don't fan the flames, Eric, the other students might forget about it. You really think information like this will just die down? There's internet. There's eavesdropper. You might be worried Pete Melman is going to kill himself, but the truth is he was dead the second he crapped his pants. All right, Eric, here's the deal. This school cannot have another suicide on its hands. We want you to see Pete Melman through this and turn public opinion around. <laughs> You're crazy. It can't be done! If Pete Melman does not kill himself, we will make it very worth your while. You aren't listening, there is no... Make it worth my while, how? Come on down south by there and meet some friends.